I'm John Oroke and here's some news. Uh, tonight Trump goes live and talks to the nation about his stance on immigration. Let's not forget that he is holding 800,000 federal employees hostage and he lies a lot all the time. Soon to probably be divorced, Kellyanne Conway has to explain those lies to the public. Today she lashed out at a reporter when he asked if the president is going to tell the truth. She one, called him a smart ass and two, said nobody likes you. That's a drunken defense. That's when you have to be like, hey man, you had too many, give me your keys. <laughs> You're a smart ass and nobody likes you. But if I was Kellyanne Conway, I'd be drinking during the day too. Ex-Republican Steve Schmidt, who was once a part of the George W. Bush White House, has a lot to say about Donald Trump's address to America. Mainly, where are the pesos? And he didn't say it like that. He said it very, very white. He said like, where are the pesos? He said it like if he was expecting change from downtown LA and the guy he was like, huh? And he's like, where are the pesos? He said like if mayonnaise learned to talk, where are the pesos? Hey mayonnaise, I'm trying to make a sandwich here. You need to calm down. But he does have a good point. Trump said the wall was going to be paid for by Mexico. Where are those pesos, man? Justin recently released an apology for not being actually paraplegic in his new movie, The Upside. He said, I understand I'm an actor and I have to play different roles. I acknowledge that I did take away a role from a disabled actor. He then also apologized for not actually making and selling meth and taking a role away from an actual meth dealer. Oh, natural. Paris France's first nude restaurant is closing its doors due to the lack of customers. However, their competitor down the street, Cock and Box, is doing great. When I read this story, it says Paris' first nude restaurant. Like, there was going to be others? Like people who want to eat around naked people. I don't want to sit around people be eating and be like, mmm, the sausage is good. And so is yours, buddy. Or how's your clam chowder? How's your clam down there? It's gross. We wear clothes because we don't like looking at other people eat naked. I've eaten naked before and was just like, this is wrong. No one is around me. No one's in my house. But I definitely should at least put on pants if I'm going to have a sandwich. I'm John Roque. Thanks for watching.